before, huh? No, we so like that was like so we we fought before on Castle, but they they basically like it was fucking unmade like base and it was all fucked up and shit from conflict, and it wasn't really that much of a fight at all. So this was like our first like official fight. It was that, I four guilds like... placed on us, and then we had autumn, Nobody. but fucking I don't know what happened to autumn. That shit was just lost in the sea, bro. Oh, we got them. We got them quick, bro. They got so, clapped so fast. Oh, yeah. oh my god. Within the first three minutes, we found their base and it was over, bro. Yeah, we wanted to kind of weaken your force a little bit, so we went after them, took them out like three minutes. And on our way back to set up in our base on the high ground, oh, dude, these guys were in our base. We're like, what? They're like, the gates, the first gates down. We're like, what the fuck, dude? Shit just yeah, went. As soon as I saw you take Sarah, Sarah made the call. Yeah. All right, Shaw, we are now live. They're, they're out. So you did, made it, you did manage to get one of the your uh, one of the opposition down out of the four is what you're saying? Yeah. 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 Kind of like ten minutes or less. Not by that time though. you were in a lot of trouble. It sounds like. Yeah. So like, so like I was like one of the first people back and fucking. So the majority of the ball, well, like not everyone's over there, but the majority of the ball they were like coming back still from downhill, and by that time. Uh, the fucking gate broke. Like, first gate broke, and, and that show was like, what the fuck, how did he break so fast? Because, obviously, I, I don't I don't expect this fucking gate to be made out of wet cardboard, so they just fucking plowed through it. They were in main court. I killed a couple people, but there was just so many because they weren't flagged up against each other, and there was two guilds all in, like, on the bridge. So there was no way our ball from coming back from the, the Serotator Shredder, whatever they're called, um, yeah, coming there, back, there was no way we were gonna be able to defend it from that side. Yeah, the first gate was... broke, the second gate was half up. That shit was wild. I'm like, how did he break? What the gate, fuck? Right on like, yeah, what's Cer going on? Yeah, Cerate's base was at the uh, uh, that little water base, kind of look, just so you can. That shit was that shit was pretty trash looking. Yeah, I told them not even yeah. that place. So I told them where places, and they went exactly. They went oh to yeah. Africa. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we heard that shit. The fucking doors were open. Fucking right, kids were out, bro. What the fuck? Yeah, yeah we're just there. The, the fucking gate was just open. I know. Like, I, come I saw on up there. Like, what the hell are they doing, dude? Gate wide open. <laughs> yeah, well, I, gate wide open. No one around. Like, I. I don't know what the fuck was going on in Neymar. Honestly, like, the P the PS4, like, fucking community isn't really as hardcore, probably, as the Xbox is. Is like, that really... why you guys can still use memes and GIFs inside of the general chat and we can't? <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> I, d I did notice that. Y'all still have access to that. We do not. We get... <laughs> we get... <laughs> You're kind of savage, yeah. They, they just gave it's no... Oh, uh, nobody... Keep saying that. And... Yo, I'm gonna start posting some porn shit. And I'm if y'all want, uh, yeah, we can come say hi. I'm gonna start, I'm gonna start posting fucking porn that. so you guys can fucking get that shit taken away. Bro, those ain't me. You just have right. Uh, NSFW. On the PS4, you know, sending tickets. Like, you know, if uh, if you have any questions, you know, here's the ticket. Use the ticket system. Every time you add a CM or something, here's the ticket. Here's the link for the tickets. That's all I'm right there. Oh, God. Bright. Uh, he's a member from their guild from Karma. After the initial push, I may want to hold you up. I was on top of the count, um, the, on top of the, the tower, drinking some Kool Aid and just, you know, just shooting. Nobody. See, they drink. Hey, hey, see. You made it on top of the castle because it was bugged. Like I, tr I was literally on top of the roof in the exact right spot. I could not get on top of there, and, and I practiced. A good four or five times before the siege, it seemed like they they patched it after. Nah, I so was you up can climb up the ladder. Nah, I climbed up the was... ladder. I was on the roof, my dude. I have a I have a question. I saw a lot of y'all like spawning like to the east of the first gate on that. That level. was a was, that that, that had was that a the only way they could have, yeah it had to be. That's outer you spawn. Know? No, we never use commander gas. I can use it when right you, now. When you take down a gate, right? If you take down the outer. 
and you get outer spawn, which means if you die in the castle, you get to spawn in the castle at that location you saw. Right. And if they take the inner gate, then you get the inner spawn. So there are two different spawns that you can have when you are offensively trying to take the castle. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah. Oh, I one agree. spawns in the middle area, the other one spawns near the outer <laughs> gate. Too. Well, yeah, I mean, at this rate, honestly, we could just do the same shit that Carnage does. Carnage could lose next week. Uh, but, I mean, if those gates are, like, that weak, I mean, cool. that castle is, is shit to hold. Honestly, this shit's garbage to hold. Watch the hell it for 11 plus weeks, I mean... I mean, we didn't know. That was our first time doing Siege, and we're just, like, we're not from Xbox or PC. Uh, I thought Sam was from PC. No, I am from PC, but I don't have a lot of Siege experience, especially in Yeah, he, did, he doesn't do Siege, he does uh, No Wars. No Wars yeah, is worse, yeah. He was, a top, he was in a top Siege. No, game. see, this is why Siege. this is why people shouldn't be talking shit, because they don't know no, shit. Like, it's, it's, a game of, it's a game of telephone. <laughs> I hear a lot of rumors and shit, and, and like, nobody's asking here. me questions, bro. Like, just straight up come ask me, yo, Sims, what's up? So, I, didn't I do run a guild on PC. Nah, I do run a guild on PC called Water. We were doing T1s for a bit. At the time when T1s was actually competitive, but we moved up ever since that. And we were definitely the top guild on T1. Like, it was like, we're talking six, seven guilds coming after us, we drop them. On Equalized, not fucking Shitter T1s, but like Equalized Gears where We moved up to T2s, we're doing all right, but we're not Black Rose or Stink. Um, so, I don't know where you guys heard that, but I've never claimed that. I don't know. Somebody in your guild talking here, you know, bro. Mm, uh, definitely after, not, dude. After, after Demon left, I was like, yeah, we got a backup shot. I call that some uh, see that message. Nah, see, yeah, the no. Demon was never the main shot. Yeah, yeah, Demon never, like, shot called, really. I heard it was so, Demon and Lucky. Nah, bro. No, see, that's the thing. Lucky, Lucky was our shot caller. So, like, did, I mean, Demon, he didn't fucking, he didn't shot call, really. The only thing he shot called for was his flex. But as far as, like, anything else, he didn't, he didn't do anything. Yeah. I don't know where that came, and I saw that in Conker's video. Yeah, I saw that in Conker's video, fucking shot caller of Karma. I'm like, shot caller of Karma? <laughs> he's easy being Karma. You got his own Merc guild. Yo, to be fair, there's no possible way that I could ever know what's going on with that fool until talk, people man. comment. Exactly, talk. bro. I do not be in server chat, ass, man. Bro. I have I have Luffy like as a as a source of communication and we talk. He's we he's our about. liaison secretary, bro. He gets us all the yeah. information. He's, he should be GM Loki. He should. You know oh, what hell no, nah, like, bro. Hell no, nah, oh, bro. Boy, hold on. Let me get some. Let me get some world check going on. Luffy for Origin GM, dude. Hold on, bro. So, so everybody, everybody wants to know, though, right? Karma Car Car dead guild right now. Karma dead guild. Dead guild. Okay, absolutely absolutely not, bro. We now we popping, bro. <laughs> I mean, I even, I even had it on a stream. I was like, "We're chill, dude." Like, honestly, and then we, we even memed in fucking guild chat. We're like, "We wanted to do No Wars anyways." Dude, why? <laughs> like, what the fuck? Nice why meme, dude. Open that gate, dude. Why bomb open that gate? So yeah, we saw that. Oh, the second yeah. gate, like that second gate. We just noticed you guys no, were walking. No, I saw, I saw that second gate, bro. The, the video in our Discord that's like uh, six fifty two p.m. PDT. Mm -hmm. um, I that shit, that shit went down in seven seconds, dude. I literally, like, uh, I no, saw no, that. Uh, no, that no, bro. That's second. That's second. Because if if you look around the environment, that um, not, not the person who so, was uh, recording it. So after we yeah, took the first see. gate, everybody kind of split up, and then there was a couple people still hitting on gate two, and then we got wiped uh, up at the base, and then everyone respawned at spawn one, and then took out gate two. Gate two was already uh, open, right? Already... No, no, it wasn't. It wasn't open. No, it was no, down, no, but it was already no. Open. It wasn't. Oh, okay, it was, okay. It was open, damaged. Because yeah, I was, was looking at a... quite a bit. That's why it looked like it got taken way faster than. No, that. no, no. It was already damaged. I can like... post the video in the, the leadership chat right now. Gate two was open. Y'all first broke the gate. Gate two was open. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we, we had it. four yeah. people yeah. go through. Yeah. Yeah. Why y'all let Bomb open it? Why y'all let Bomb open it? Know. That's what I'm saying. Like we were looking, I was looking at video proof. Like somebody ran up to the first gate, but before they got to the first, before you guys took out the first gate, 
our second gate was open and i was like that doesn't make sense i, I don't know who yeah. did, but that's just what yeah y'all yeah, didn't know i had lines i could fly over walls yeah. uh, no we knew that already yeah, yeah we already knew about the back line. mountain shit no like we knew you guys could get past we just didn't like we were trying to figure out what happened with that gate in specific Hey, hey forget sense. all about that gate. Stop questioning it. That gate was just open. Don't worry about who opened it. Don't worry. Shut your ass up, boy. <laughs> that's, that's hella sus. This man out here messaging Thunder and fucking Wait. Blizz. I'm like, damn, y'all weird. <laughs> the fuck? Home. Like, come on home, bro. This ain't country road again. <laughs> the fuck? Yeah, I, mean, I, I can send y'all all the messages. Oh, damn. I, bro, I don't. I do not want to see your little grinder chat with Blink, bro. Oh my god, I do not want to see any of this. Oh hell no, nah, you got me fucked up. Oh, you mean used to roll? Yo, hold on, bro. I heard, I heard something about a teddy bear, bro. Hold on. <laughs> I be hearing about this no, shit all the time, no, my god. No, 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 Yumi, you wanna know how? Because I, I didn't know you was Yumi when you changed to the Musa and we was arguing. And then you was like, I was like, I was like, you probably white anyway. And then he was like, I'm black. I was like, who are you? He, nigga. It's Yumi. I was like, how many people are Sarate Brain? Uh, not enough. No, I'm pretty. It wasn't. It was nowhere near enough, dude. I think the G. What did she say? She said her internet went out. I honestly, at this point, I would not believe anything that person says. They're just the fucking liar. They were talking in server chat like they did something. I'm like, bro, who's your guild again? I didn't even know their guild was still around until someone said that they were gonna play. So I'm like, huh? That guild's still. Rip. Oh, you might die. And somebody <laughs> shut him up. Damn, bro. <laughs> oh my god. And they shut his ass up. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, bro. My, my fucking my my mic unplugged, bro. That's what it was. <laughs> he was getting too excited, dude. No, but like honestly, I had no idea they were even still a fucking relevant or like alive or anything. I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> Yuki Styles a guild kind of shit. It's weird. Big weird. Yikes, My do you got any, is... anything to say about anything that happened? Yikes got taken out. I see, I see you Real quick. There. Not by us, no. but somebody took them out fast. Yikes was still in it till the end. How y'all plan yeah. on defending next week? What you mean, bro? We was chilling. Yikes was not get taken out. Until yeah, yeah was Yikes was, al was alive for quite a while there. Yikes lasted longer than Karma, my was, dude. Well, because, I mean, Origin could never fight us one-on-one. -on -one. Karma just could. Hey, hey, but, but y'all decked <laughs> on a three day old guild, and what happened? Okay, so no, so here's oh. the thing. So here's the thing about that. I already told you what I thought about you. I already told you what I thought about you, unless you want me to repeat it in here. That's some wild shit, honestly. Yeah. I mean, it was, you know, yeah, like I told you, I, I already told you, I didn't give a shit what you did with your guild if you wanted to leave or whatever. It's just you want to come at our neck like you're not, um, like you were never part of karma and then i have your members screenshotting your chats and telling me fucking this is supposed to be a community guild but all it is is just another shitty t4 guild trying to be a siege guild so the thing about so, that I is mean, it's opinionated right our community not, but, but that's it, it, our it's community like, is doing great anything like it, it's bro like you can't have t people telling me from your, your guild that it's more of a dictatorship if I mean, and then how you, honest, and then you I mean, kick somebody because Coca is complaining about something. You just deem people unworthy and you kick them. Yeah, that's actually not the case, bro. Yeah, it's so, completely not the case, bro. Nah, You're taking things all, all out of balance. All out of balance, my dude. Something you don't know, bro. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. People don't know about going right back to it. Matter of fact, that brings us to a good point, though. Let's let Coca really speak about that. So. You know, apparently you got somebody crying to you about something that happened in Origin. So, Coco, what did, what did that member say to you that made me kick him? Because, you know, everybody in Origin knows. I tell everybody that joins Origin, if you join my guild, you, you won't be one for spy. If somebody don't follow the rules, that's on them, right? I tell everybody that you give people a chance to be our friend before you make them our enemy. I tell everyone, don't let me catch you in server chat talking reckless. That's not a dictatorship. You're representing Origin. 
We are a family. I don't want to catch anybody in server chat talking reckless. I don't want to catch you anywhere talking reckless. You respect everyone. So, Coca, my dude, Coca, what was that member whispering you that made me kick him in front of you? Oh, which one, bro? Virgin, dude. That nigga was all over the place, bro. Holy shit. Nocturnal. Wow. The, the one I just talked to you about what, what, was, what was even What was even the issue, bro? Like, that he had to... Uh, so, like, Nocturnal hit me up, like, three days ago. He asked me for a GBG. I told him, wait for uh, Conquerors to get on, and we'll discuss him, whatever. So, I'm off flying and shit. He gets on, he starts messing. GBG, my officer would say, yo, wait for Coca. Instead of waiting, he starts talking shit in the world chat. Oh, we can't spell out barcode's name, all this bullshit, bro. Just going crazy reckless, bro. So I get on, I'm like, yo, what's your problem? He starts coming at me for, for no reason, bro. I ain't done nothing to this kid. He's just keyboard warrior, bro, straight up. That's all it was, bro. And up oh, until I hopped in the chat, he just <laughs> like, so, I don't want anybody representing my guild that's going to call out another guild. Not on, uh, not on my word. You're, you're calling out another guild? Disrespecting them? Not on my word? How the hell? Like, I promoted this dude to officer. So, how the hell could I let that shit ride? If I let an officer ride I on did, that? I, I did hear some someone and, say something homie, about um, and hold on, he was hold on, calling homie. a GBG. I'm like, from Origin Discord, bro. He kicked me from Origin Discord so I could not I defend know, him. Dude. And he was moving me from voice channel to voice channel when I was trying to explain to Conquerors what happened, bro. That kid's weird as fuck. Oh, I don't yeah, know he how he got me. up in that shit. No, dude, that's not <laughs> right, bro. Yeah, I didn't pick up. He called me at 1 a.m. And he got to saying, oh, so you don't want to talk to me. I huh? forgot about then, that. I'm like, I'm like, what are you talking about? He said, I got information on karma. I said, everybody got information on karma. Then he just got to, <laughs> he just got to act a weird as fuck. Like, man. Maybe Vicky karma. What you mean? Of course, everybody. It's like if for karma, dude, our Discord is not like even if somehow a spy did get into karma, I'm just like, dude, our Discord's full of memes and toxicity towards each other. Like, obviously, like frenzy, friendly shit, like nothing well, fucking serious. But I started feeling karma, and they'll be kicking me out of Discord. So y'all, nigga, I don't even know who you are. I don't fucking be kicking people like that. I don't give a Man. Shit. Wait, I don't even. Wait, hold on. Who are you? All I know, bro, I was supposed to be no. VIP in karma, bro. What happened to my yeah, VIP dude. tag? Nigga, that video happened. Oh, yo, oh, yo. Oh, my God. What happened to my VIP tag? I'll tell you what happened. I mean, why would I give you a VIP tag? It, it, let, let's be honest about that. I'll explain it to you. Bro, wait. I love everybody. Wait. I want to talk about why I left PS4. Oh, no, dude, not the meme, that's bro. That's what happened. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I mean, because, like, I was, I was looking at, um... So I kicked a bunch of people out. I kicked a, a bunch of people from like Carnage and fucking Origin. They were just sitting in Discord. I mean, they were just they weren't. I mean, they weren't saying anything. Some of them have been in there for like a, fucking like a week or so. They didn't say anything. They weren't trying to interact with anybody. They were just sitting in there trying to see if they could see any info or whatever. And I'm just like, after I left Exile, I was like, oh, yeah. I mean, I was just I was just like kicking people. That it's like. Yeah, I mean, I don't know, dude. I've, I've kicked a lot of people. I don't even, I didn't even know you were in the in the Discord at hey, all. Hey, but wait a second, wait a second. this man's texting me again. He said, "Grabs on the wind." Did you block me? Question mark, sir? Question mark? <laughs> like, uh, <laughs> wow. Uh, that's like your yeah, ex, cause, bro. Cause that, cause that dude, that dude came to me, right? And he was telling me that fucking origin origin kicked him and fucking conquers of this and they're acting wild i'm like, I was like bro it's like i don't i don't know what it's like what to think about the whole thing I'm like, so what? here's my thing i will never in my life trust somebody who comes to me with somebody else's dirty laundry i will never trust you i will always keep you under watch because if you're going to do the same thing to them you'll do it to me right right you can't trust people like that, bro. And one hundred percent, like like I said, I I've always been upfront about anything that I that I've said, anything that I've put out. Yes, I am about peace and love, my dude. But when somebody fucks with me or my family, bro, that shit go out the window. Clean out the Why window, dude. We at war. That's like, nah, that's like yesterday. That, calling that out dude, people that dude. Chat, slapping out everybody. Yeah, now, that dude, nah, that that boy G quit, bro. He, I mean, not G quit. He he's gone, but he left again. Uh, 
Okay. That boy left the game a while ago too, like you know, two weeks or some shit. No, the real question is, let that nigga pay homage. Who? Pay homage. (laughs) Now that man, that was the homie. That was legit my favorite person in Connor. Bring him back. That boy, that boy's been gone for. Yeah, I remember seeing him the first month, and then like three one days. Bro, yeah, that's about right. He was on everybody's friends list. He coming back when Striker release. Nah, he too busy for all that shit. I talked to him. I know him for like almost two years. Fucking, he's too busy for that shit. IRL. This game real, dude. This game real. Shit. Next topic. Next topic. Yo, Adam, how was how was the uh, how was the seed from your angle? (laughs) <laughs> what were you guys looking at? What happened at the beginning? What's popping? Oh, we didn't really see shit at the beginning. We actually, uh, we chilled for a second, and then we headed off towards uh, where the shit was going on and just kind of watched the fucking shit show happen from the outside. Like, they got, like, it was quick. Like, Carnage just kind of rolled in there. And then yeah. we we couldn't fight, of course, you know, because we're not, we were there to back up Carlos. So we couldn't fucking <laughs> back anybody until they were dead. True, and true, true. fucking uh, the moment the moment they went down, we ran into Carnage. Our fucking ball met up with them. We had like one wipe on them outside their base, and they came out and cleaned us up on their like respawn. And then we got uh, pushed by pretty much everybody at once. <laughs> gotcha. Right. Yeah, we had fucking our fucking high watch a dude lagged out right in front of fucking Jack. He messaged me afterwards. It was just like, "Yep, there's a hole," and they just fucking rolled right in that. Damn, I think we covered all the guilds, right? Uh, not well. Yeah, everything that happened on Kelsey, I'm not necessarily um. Uh, true. Sarah not in here. Miyuki, Miyuki's having a a fit. Well, was having a little tiny fit. Uh, they had a comment. Uh, what, what exactly did they say? Hold on. They said, said, imagine bringing half their guild to fight one base. Strong IQ tactics. It's like, your base is literally next to the fucking castle. Like, what? And like, how you, gonna, yeah. how, you gonna, how you gonna tell me if you weren't in our position, uh, you wouldn't have slapped the shit out that. <laughs> Miyuki like, does that juice every time they lose they, they, every fucking time. They, every they time. always tie, and then they're trying to say like I had like a uh, a thing for them. I'm like I don't even know you. <laughs> Can we get a Serate representative in here, dude? I don't. I mean, I don't even know if they're in the Discord. Honestly. <laughs> honestly, they they shouldn't have been mad. I mean, they bro, like this is not. The first occasion that we fought them, and we've decked them fucking first month, and same shit happened again, like it happened before. It's like they're not a strong guild, bro. I don't even know why they even uh, had like this yeah. contemplation that they would like, like even if uh we didn't get knocked out and Carnage did, it's like what did they think would happen still? It's gonna be the same shit over and over. It doesn't matter what guild they fight, whether it's Carnage, Excel, or fucking us, they would have got knocked yeah. out either way. They're easy as fuck, though. Yeah, who's gonna take? They out are. Bro. That's not just me sitting there. I ain't get no. Fuck. Nobody plays on exile, which is actually the super super. I think everyone wanted to take uh, Serendia because it was fucking empty. Yeah, I saw like ten exile on the edge of the rocks, just watching the shit show. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, when crossplay comes out, Coca, you should come uh, fight the real Coca with body on Xbox. Oh. Whoa, who said that? Whoa, that was real swift. Who said that? Hey, Xbox be talking mighty spicy knowing that there's a non merger happening right now. Yeah, Y'all I'm gotta... just saying, bro, yeah. when crossplay releases, bro, come get body by the real Coca. Alright, that's that's right. Oh, hey, Coca. <laughs> Put his name <laughs> down, right? PC, not, don't know what you're talking about. Oh shit. Yo, I can't I can't wait for crossplay because I'm tired of body and all the PS4 kids in world chat that ain't a competition. All I hear is T1 T1 T1. They too easy Josh, they too easy out here, bro. Oh Luffy, you hear you've been uh, appointed to new GM? I have. <laughs> no nigga. Crazy. <laughs> you said I have? Damn bad at this fan. <laughs> yeah, you said it like about time. I'm going back. I'm taking my talents back to Carmel. He yeah, said, man. "He said, hold on. About time I should have GM." <laughs> Raven, 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 send me my Carmel. Like, oh my god. 
<laughs> hey, we got Sarah Tay up in here, y'all. Oh, we taking the castle. That's, that's, that's a lot. Really, I mean, castle, I mean, even if that castle is shitty as fuck to hold, <laughs> we still gonna back for it. Whatever, bro. Oh, we know you are. Yeah, bro, come take it from us, bro. Who said that shit? Who is us? Nigga, you in Origin. Us? Oh, I never, I never, I never understood that. I didn't know Carnage needed help, dude. Carnage, huh? is, my, Carnage is my jump DLC. So tell you, you on the Carnage. <laughs> Are you trying to say that Carnage is under Origin because you consider them a jump kill? Oh, God. Carnage yeah. is my kill. I go to the scene, sir. Oh. <laughs> Looks like Luffy needs a home, oh. though. He ain't sounding yeah, too well over there right now. Mm. Nah, bro. Don't worry, Luffy. You have a spot in the server. I got a spot. <laughs> no, you got a spot in Cure. Nick. You got a spot in Cure. <laughs> Dude, that's toxic, bro. Oh my god, they made those people disband. Wait, who made them disband? Who cared, man? I don't know, bro. People were bullying the shit out of Cure like the first month, bro. <laughs> the first month, people were just mad talking shit. So. Oh my god, they were like low key hated so bad, dude. I was just like, damn, who hurt you? <laughs> I think a lot of these lower guilds need to disband, man. We need more competition in the PS4 community. They should just, they should just merge, honestly. Man, fuck them lower guilds, for real, for real. Oh, that's the problem. You got, you got everybody and their mother that wants a guild, you know? I mean, you got 50 Damn. guilds with 20 members in it, it's like... That's what I'm saying. They should just merge, be big guilds, and go for Siege. Or at least do Node Wars and then go for Siege. It's gonna be a rude awakening when Arsha comes out. I mean, uh, we've tried, we've reached out. Bitches don't wanna. Nah, no, everyone like, wants their guild name. They want their name. Cause, it, cause I mean, if, if you think about it, when it comes to the territories, nobody really challenged. Like, first week, Carnage and Karma, we both got a free territory. Cause ain't nobody wanted to fight either guild. But they fought, they'll fight Exile. So, I mean, I, I don't know what that's, that's supposed to say. Bro, but, uh... <laughs> but, don't worry uh, about Exile, bro. They don't... Don't worry about it. Dude, they got... Uh, uh, Okay. Uh, nah, they got they got Mike now, Mike CM. Little do y'all know, uh, my GM now. Yikes, number one. Yeah. Guild. Everybody knows that my Yikes is number one guild on the server, oh, dude. Na, I don't, I don't even want to hear from Carnage. Everyone knows, big Yikes, dude. Big Yikes, big chat, dude. Oh my god. I heard Yikes took twenty members to a seat. Snatch it. Mm, even though they struggled to take out Slay. Mm. Yeah. Like a T1 guild. Oh yeah, we gotta welcome in our fellow, our fellow, uh, T's and people now. Slay Station, bro. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta. Yo, yeah, season, yo, tell me why these Slay Station dudes got beefy. What the fuck? Yeah, that was beefy. Bro, they just got a whole new, they just, they got a, they brought as beefy as top ramen noodles, bro. I, I mean, I mean, I mean, they, they no sauce, really dog. now a siege guild. Officially today, they're a siege guild. That boy, Rob Nettin, you finna have it, you finna have it. Rob Nettin, you mean ramen? Fuck, this PlayStation's been pushing Siege for so fucking long, though. Hey, hey y'all wanna know how bad oh, it yeah. was on PlayStation when they had dropped three guilds um, when we had Serenia? We legit, didn't you? Know, we sent half our people. Oh, yeah, I remember that. Yeah, it was a... <laughs> I remember that. Goddamn. PlayStation just has raw numbers. They're not even that good. Like, yeah, you know, that's what it comes down to. Like, hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. They, they, had, they had way too many people, bro. We almost yeah. had them, too. They're at 35% when it was done. Hey, like, all their top geared oh, members are like Mooses yeah, and Warriors, though, bro. Go fight in Fucking Remington dude. told me they had about their whole core was above 500. So I'm like, damn, their whole core. I was like, how big your core? He was like, 15 to 20. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I can tell I'm you like, why their core is powerful. But yet they're still pulling like 45 to 50 in the freaking node. Uh, oh, siege no. at least. Shit, at least. Pulled, yeah. They pulled yeah. Yeah. They pulled oh, yeah. Wait, they and I feel like we okay, that, we okay. still would have pushed them out if we had our whole watches out. That's an Xbox nigga in here. I kid you not. We us building the base. I, I legit, me and Nemesis was just over there talking to him while we was building the base. 
That same night, they only brought three people to that note. I'm just like, they brought three people. Yeah. Yeah, because they seen us building. They said they didn't want to fight. Bro, so. uh, So the the real question I want to ask: So who paying for this Carmage name change? (laughs) (laughs) Wild. (laughs) You send it. You send it. I change his name to Carmage. Bro, no. Damn, we about to get beat up by an Xbox. <laughs> I'm about to get shit on. So like, yeah, damn, they're like, y'all thought that you had ego. So I'm like, oh hell no, my bad. I apologize. I play on the play on the right. Switch now. Hold on. Little do you know. I play on the Switch now. I play mobile. Hold on, bro. Yeah, Twitch video confirmed. <laughs> I mean, it's mobile now, so we might as well do shit. Yeah. <laughs> Who about like, oh, that's... Xbox? Uh-huh. Damn, we all we all gonna get shit on. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> you want to fight people in ten and ten in a mix of both? I'm like, hold on, bro. I apologize. No, no, you know no, what? Yeah. I didn't even know this was Black Desert. Hold on, bro. Let, let, hold on. Let me back yeah, out. Let that, me log out. That crossplay doesn't need to happen. <laughs> Oh, yeah, that's Minecraft. What the? Oh, uh, yeah, I know, I know it will, but it shouldn't happen. Why not? Right. Well, they said it ain't gonna happen. I'm gonna fight people in 2024. <laughs> <laughs> they literally have like a six-month head start. <laughs> that shit. That, 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 that shit won't be till. That shit won't be till like March or April. We're looking. Let's be honest. Oh, yeah. Yo, sure. when <laughs> Xbox merges, people are gonna realize their meaning of alliances, bro. If you don't have good allies, you don't have good yeah. friends. You are gonna have a bad time. When Archer That's comes true. out, you don't have allies. You don't have friends. You're gonna have a bad time. I don't know why a lot of the like, in my opinion, I don't know why a lot of the the smaller guilds not want to jump on the on Siege. I'm bro, saying like, that, we, that's we what I'm trying to figure so out. People. We don't got our ass kicked, but it's fun at the bare minimum. Like it's not yeah. fun if you're not challenging somebody. Like goddamn. Right. That's the whole point like of BDO. Jump on people. I'm just like, yeah, but if you get trashed, if you get trashed too hard, then it's a big morale like dump. So yeah, yeah but <laughs> you got you gotta be able to put up a little fight. But yeah, like I mean, but you gotta keep pushing though. Like you don't yeah. become. Oh yeah, you don't, absolutely. Like bro, in, in the beginning, like in the first month, it was literally us against Carnage, and we always beefed it. We we always yeah. beefed it throughout that whole shit, and and we still do. And it's like it's like we have a perma deck, and it, it's only because if we didn't have that perma deck with Carnage, there ain't no PvP in this game, dog. Like yeah. and, and it's simple how it is because pe- people on here. Like compared to like Xbox or especially even PC, there's so many people on this game that's soft as shit. Like so many small guilds, they're just they see uh, us or they see Carnage or fuck. Let's even throw Exile in the mix, and they don't even want that shit. They don't want those problems yeah. because they're like, oh, those are big established guilds. It's like, but what people don't realize is they can become that too. Yeah. Like shit. Like both. Like all the top guilds right now. We have to build that shit from the bottom to where we're at currently. And it's like, yeah, you know, this week we lost. Next week we could take it back, and then we'll probably lose it again. And it'll be just back and forth. But at the end of the day, I mean, we're, we all PvP. You know, we actually get to have that BDO experience for once, at least fucking once a week, since somebody's, like, organizing GBGs or nothing like that. So it's only it's the only thing we could really push for. And if we could push for that shit every single week, uh, these smaller guilds can establish themselves or at least try to like move up in the node wars. T ones, that ain't shit. At least start yeah, out like T yeah. twos and move up to T fours. Yeah. They can be like thirty man T fours, like establish yourself first and then move up. The big difference is oh, yeah, your Karma ones are pathetic. And Carnage came with the school <laughs> at the beginning that we were able to get a lot of those members. A lot of members were like, "Yeah, to be a part of this." Yeah, we were, but I mean, at the same time, we can't we can't hinder ourselves. Neither guild can hinder ourselves. <coughs> So, so, let's, 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 let's not lie, man. I mean, everyone wanted to be on Karma at the beginning. Everyone, they still want to be on Karma. Everyone. Ooh. They still want to. Yeah, exactly. I didn't ever kill Nah, I, just, I mean, I know there's... Well, well, we obviously... Here, G, here's your boy, but come on, face. We Karma game right here now. I was a oh, killer. Man. People was like, G, I was like, the main thing I had at the beginning of the game, nobody on PS... Like, at the beginning... Bro, you would have seen PS4. There's only like a handful of people that will willingly go at GVGs. 
I told you, ain't nobody want India. Ain't nobody wants to do that shit besides our guilds. It's just literally how it was. My nigga, you lagging and... like hell. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> really do. Them Xbox niggas said we uh bitch dick. Literally, we got a little of the latency. We. Yo, but let's talk. Let's niggas talk about already making everybody, memes and everything. Everybody bro. thought that we 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 lost the online. Right. So. Even for us, like we we dropped on Exile like the second week, and then when we was the last against them, like they even like they didn't instantly destroy us. We had like a little thirty thirty to uh, scrimmage, like you know, just practicing with them before they destroyed our shit. You know, like I don't mind dropping on people, but I just feel like a lot of the smaller guilds are just scared to drop on. Them. <laughs> then they talk shit in world chat and then expect people not to go clap them. Who got this talking right now? Uh, honesty, Luna. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, that yeah, that was that was Theo from Ludo. Uh, when he changed his name. Eight PC. I mean, that's really the reason as to why Origin has started. I'm gonna be honest with y'all. We we got a good fifty people who are completely new to this game, and then we have you know our top eighteen who are actually OGs. Yeah. And I guarantee we have people that came in this guild at three sixty gear score. They're now pushing five hundreds. We, we have turned completely new people into warriors, and anybody that has waged war on Origin has quickly learned that we don't back down, and we will place. I need to see the community take that same example, bro. I want to see the community take that and, and, and use that same energy to create more guilds to have a more competitive field. We need more competition in BDO BS4. We do have too many soft guilds, and that's a problem. It's yeah, a huge really problem. Is. Too many people content I mean, with falling behind. It's we do too have too many, many guilds. Like all right, all right. Well, yeah. let's, all, let's all merge, bro. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Too many of y'all niggas that I don't like. Can't do that. Every nigga that's in the guild that's 500 gear score, we just all gonna go to another guild, bro. Gonna make our own shit. <laughs> we need a good, like, I, I, solid I, seven strong... T4 and Siege guilds, like a good solid 700 man guild. Yeah, it's for GM, that's what I heard. What's up Jack. with uh, Jack's guild? Jack. Oni, Oni, uh, Oni Mashi? Jack, you, you ready, Jack? Ominous? Who Jack, you ready? Uh, uh, <laughs> me, you, and Nemesis. Uh, me and Nemesis have been talking about just doing a two man guild and just Bro, clearing all the T1 hurry, nodes. Hurry up, hurry up and make the guild so I can join. Who who said my name? <laughs> bro, only uh, your voice too damn deep, though. Hey, yo, I'm Audi. Y'all T1 guilds have a good one. It was nice listening <laughs> to you. <laughs> yeah, Xbox yeah. people, dog. No manners. Yeah, yeah, bro. All right, fuck, you, ass, you fuck ass, dirty ass, ass Xbox bro. niggas. Fuck y'all. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta stop coming at my homeland like that. Bro, when, when this shit, when they merge, <laughs> bro, when they merge, they get in their asses. Come on. So, <laughs> when the merch happens, it's literally going to be Xbox vs. PS4. I hope you guys are making that shit. Whoa, whoa, I'm hopping in. Bro, we already soft cap, bro. Come on now. Nigga, no. Alright, bro. Hey. hey. <laughs> shit, I'm ready for Kaffers to drop because this game's too fucking easy. Dandy, <laughs> we already got two guilds on both systems. Most of us go with that Wait, wait. Who on. said that? <laughs> <laughs> two guilds. <laughs> <laughs> That must have been a Carnage player. Who said that, bro? Nah. <laughs> nah. Nah, there's, an, there's a fucking full autumn guild on Xbox. Uh, yeah, same, look, same guild. Look, bro, I see the Xbox snake in here. His name Wavy. You see him? He's just there. <laughs> <All right. laughs> Wait, Wavy? Mm. Wait, bro, he just... He... Hey, he's chilling, I see him in there. He look, he listen to Andy. This is PS4, it's bro. Like it's PS4. Bro. It's PS4. Yeah, yeah, Luffy, you need this is like me too, bro. Yeah, this thing is like Xbox services, yeah, bro. Don't don't come over here. Let me be. Alright, nigga, you gonna be the reason why I always want to be back first, nigga. <laughs> that's fine. That's fine. I'm that card, sir. Hey, what are you doing? Yeah, I am. Let's not be there, brother. Look, yeah, I see, I see you, bro. Yeah, look. About the fuck PS4 people out there, for sure. Oh shit. Yeah, you all already know. Look, look, me and that deal scores, you know, everybody in my guild there are Xbox players now, you know. Side. Mm hmm. Mm -mm. They think they really gonna beat us, bro. That's crazy. <laughs> 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 them niggas ain't got no type of costumes, bro. Them niggas sitting over try at Xbox, bro. 
<laughs> yeah, they were talking about buying all our costumes that's when they merged. I'm like, boy. Right, what I heard was, that's why some of broke bro. niggas who don't spend money on costumes. Yeah, I, I, I just blew 34 pen attempts on a 60 stack for the lols because crowns are so abundant. I don't need crowns, bro. Just buy your pens, bro. Come on. Yo, there ain't nobody on PS4 having the balls to push pens Damn, except that's like crazy. people. <laughs> people were still, people were still like, oh, I'm rolling, I'm rolling, <laughs> three months into the game, like, damn. Your pens, nigga. Just what? Are we not pushing penicillas, or that's what I thought? Like, what? <laughs> They're best in slot, actually. Yeah, you're right. I, I don't have a pen. I don't have a pen. The damage. <laughs> penicillas from Aukman grinding all day. Mm -hmm. you, you talk about pen. When y'all start pinning bears, that's what Bro, the first thing I saw pen was the fucking the Solos mech. I was like, oh my god. And then the bear's fucking, uh, the bear's belt. I'm like, huh? Yep. <laughs> I was like, damn, people are going for some hey, weird man. shit. <laughs> you know, <laughs> but until Wanna then, buy pen, I don't want to hear it. Belt, not on my level. Price. You ain't got pen bears, you're not on my level. <laughs> <laughs> I'm talking about a whole set. He's in a whole bag. A whole set. I really wish I knew that their reaction when they got a pen bears fucking belt, dude. They're like, you know pen what? Pen or go home. I, bro, I saw that pen, uh, pen reblath onto you. I was like, oh, dude, feels bad. <laughs> <laughs> no, there's actually like, a lot of people with pen reblath. Sadly. All they so do sad. is, um, after they hit the pen, they just uh, consume it for the 70 stack. <laughs> I mean, might as well. Can't do shit with it. Why you hit that bitch wrong? Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, nigga, that's, what, that's what the Xbox players do. They just wear it. fucking pen rebluff everything, dude. All pen. Oh, that'd be crazy, actually. All pen rebluff. Hold on. Hey, wait, do you hear them, though? What's up? You hear them, though? Have JPEX come in here and want to be asking taller, dude. <laughs> yo, JPEX? Yo, 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 yo. They, they don't want the smoke, bro. JPEX. I've bought JPEX. Yeah, we we just gotta fucking get fucking JPEGs and Jokers out of retirement, man. Uh, I'm not gonna be right for them. Hey, I'm not watching um, Jokers 1v2, um, Dragoony, and Murder Happy. He 1v2 with yeah. them after his teammate died. I was like, I don't want no smoke. Yeah, the fucking. Back in the day when I fought Jokers. Like, we would fight 20 times, and I would only kill him once. Like, <laughs> it was... I was so happy just to kill him once, bro. You know what that's uh, I, fuck, I fucking took my win. I fucking did, bro. Trust me, you baby. We need to get uh, some guild petitions going between everybody, though. And fucking petition some actual arena MMR, like, actual competitive shit in video, man. Speaking of that, tournaments? I gotta go. I mean, the only people who host that tournament is like that Shadow Moon fucking guild and shit. No, I mean an actual tournament with brackets that's pre-planned with over hundred dollars worth of prizes, yeah. not no twenty-five dollar gift card, bro. Cause ain't nobody showing Why up to that, on, bro. Twenty-five dollar mean a lot around here. What you talking about? That's Come so on, like, no bro. Fucking art yeah. that, is, bro. Like, that that really uh, not many. Yeah, we're gonna be doing it in our guild here soon. Five dollar entry, winner takes all. Five dollars. No, nah, giving out money. Five dollars. You asking too much. Five dollars. Is it bold of you to assume I have five dollars? I'll donate. <laughs> you you bold for assuming that. <laughs> I'm trying to have a first tournament before December ends, and I mean like Ooh. a like a hundred man plus tournament, bro. That's a lot of organization for no hundred man. Yeah. Oh, Oh, yeah. Yeah. You can have a time, I'm about to do all this. Yeah, shit. Hey, game. BDO is life, bro. What you mean? I mean, I'll join it, but I ain't organized it. Oh, hell no. <laughs> I'll do organization. I just need to see how many people are interested, man. I'm about to get some big yeah. real life payouts real soon, bro. And I'm trying to throw shit. money, dude. I don't know, dude. Fucking yeah. drop a link. Fucking put a poll. Or drop something. a link. It's gonna be a poll. It's gonna be tryouts because it ain't no reason having no no lower than yeah, five hundred like gear that, score dude. people in a tournament. If you're not, if you lower than five hundred gear score, you might as well not even sign up. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Shit, by the, by the December, there. like 
Dude, in December. December, a lot of people should be pushing soft cap or at least it's like yeah that's the that's point that's what i'm saying that's the point sure. yeah hey y'all said you're about to help me get soft cap so do something me the muskies oh hell no you still ain't got your musty muskies bro oh, damn damn if uh, you saw get wrecked muscle. by me in rbf you might be able to roll night vendor more kakashi <laughs> 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 You can't for your man. Hey, my man's Josh was over in fucking in 3v1 and me with another witch and fucking in what a DK. I was I don't know, getting upset. I had a line that was 200 gears to it. I was like, why did you queue up? <laughs> Yo, Cockers was having the same shit. He had uh, Luminosity and uh, Dread try to 3v1 me in RBF today, and I was fucking. I was just taking out everybody else. His who was trying to get me surviving because it's hilarious and anybody that's like under 520 gear score just gets one shot and run away heal up go back who the fuck is talking right now that's joshua the man got 500 dp oh well, my mama mo <laughs> that's the guy that slaps everybody in world chat right in front of everybody else in ba yeah i want to see that shit go down when motherfucking striker drop oh uh, you sound like luffy PSN. all right nigga. He I sound mean, like Luffy. I mean, I mean when when Striker drops, when Striker drops, when Striker drops, that shit gonna drop a lot of Witchers, man. It's gonna drop somewhere out real quick. We need that. We need that diversity, yeah. bro. It's it's like yeah, like well, Black Clover online no, right now. We we just need Strikers to fuck too many Witchers. <laughs> yeah, it's nasty. Shy, so I can reload Shy. Shy, you trolling? Anybody want fucking Shy? You trolling? One v one me then. I'd rather have Valks, honestly, that's right. over a shot. Playing ass out of here. It's gonna be that's hilarious it. Wednesday when Striker drops though. You're gonna see like 40% of the BDO community that don't know how to play their Striker, yeah. You're not wrong, dude, you're not wrong. We're gonna be like, well, wasn't good at this one, gonna roll the face one. Everybody I fight with DP accessories, I, I'm assuming <laughs> that they're re-rolling Striker, and I'm just like, you're rolling DP like, accessories? Well, plug in my uh, Zim Apex, well, yeah. damage yeah. class? On the keyboard? Uh, Spike, rolling again? Huh? The spike. No. Uh, what? Nigga? Uh, yeah, never mind. Y'all, y'all are scared. <laughs> he just started saying random shit just out of nowhere. No, <laughs> no, he was asking. Oh, he, he was They're asking if again. this spike was gonna reroll. Oh. I don't, I don't know. Probably will. We, we'll keep tabs on this pilot. Wait, ain't he in your guild? Yeah, but he always on some fucking wild shit. I don't care. I, don't, I honestly, I, he takes too much energy out of me just to keep tabs on him. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, you know what, dog? Uh, do you? <laughs> like, I don't even know what to tell you, though. Hmm. Everybody decking on Slay Station because I don't want to be a part. Of anything. Oh, yeah. Was they invited to the community? Yeah. I went to the Discord. They, they in the community? Said, no, thank you. Yeah, man, That's fuck Slay Station. Yeah, yeah, they didn't want to. They didn't want to join the chat. Yeah, because they didn't have any excuses for what went down tonight. They didn't prepare that far. They just took that free that free dub. Oh, you talking about? Did they do all? Oh, uh, um... Yeah, no, I ca I told yeah. you, Ominous is not gonna hold that shit on their own. No. Another no, ancient Ominous, weapon core. Ominous died before we did. They couldn't even push us. Yeah, let's 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 make sure we we know that uh we obviously did not get taken out by. Uh, I know half the server thought uh we lost in this. So I have it. Oh. <laughs> People were like, oh, yep, Carnage done. Oh, that no, wasn't Ominous true. Ominous lasted oh, like thirty minutes. I'm not sure why. Yeah. It, 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 how many nodes are there? Uh, five or six? Yeah. We, we haven't don't... even really been pushing. Hey, so we got 10 man hysteria or what? We was two manning earlier. What do you need 10 for? Uh, <laughs> you get that, do, uh, that tongue grab necklace or nah? Bro, we was there for an hour. We got a good like 12 million trash and nothing else, just trash. That's not enough, coach. We need Arsha. 
that without was, Archer, I don't think Ackman and Hysteria are viable. Like you can farm oh, it efficiently. Ackman is definitely viable. I can if go get good, thirty like, mil an hour down there. Just dude, trash it. What? Uh, what you doing? Yeah. So what do you mean we need Archer? Dude, I've been doing it. I, I posted the first tongue frag. Solo? I got a video to prove it. Solo? Solo. That's the you, AP you monkey shit, dude. Got your class, my guy. Which is not, to go down I'm here. not an AP monkey, bro. No, I'm only actually, you know, tech cool them. After the 209, technically, you can go down there. I'm at, with you. I'm at like 190. I'm he is capping. You stop capping? I'm Cap and oh, I'll show you the video. Boy, they, they said where oh, the video at, bro. I tried <laughs> Ackman and I tried Hysteria. It was duo, bro. I was averaging, you know, 15 to 12 mil an hour, bro, but it wasn't no ton grads. No, 30 mil an hour? Huh? What the fuck? Nah. I mean, he's solo, though. I mean, I know 30 mil an hour solo. Well, I mean, Conker, you can't go down there expecting an auto attack. Everything is dying. It's like. I mean, Witcher's strong, not that strong, though. <laughs> what, you, what you trying to say, bro? Raven, hit, hit, hit my PMs real quick. I, I'll send you a link. Why do you want to see that? <laughs> he ain't trying to see that shit because he ain't a Witcher. <laughs> ah. You should be down there. Moose's, Moose's supposed to be loving it down there. Moose's get one shot by Ackman. Don't make one false move, dude. I don't get one shot by any. You got one shot by Josh. <laughs> no, no, that was one combo. It wasn't one. Oh my bad. Yeah, it it wasn't my... one combo. I mean, there's no way a DP witch could do all that damage unless they have no DP. I mean, it was one combo. I mean, it's on video, but. <laughs> no, I'm saying like no. We're we're, ta we're talking the difference between one combo. And... Yeah, yeah, no, it wasn't one shot, it was one combo. <laughs> okay, my bad. I mean, my thanks for the correction. If I had a class that I needed Oh, uh, here we go. Oh boy. <laughs> I already knew where this was shit was at <laughs> 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 uh, Wait till Striker come out, bro. My nigga, how many how many seasons is I gonna take this man? How many no words are I gonna take this? Oh, what? So you gotta bring up Node Wars because you ain't shit 1v1? How many L's are you gonna win? How many L's you gonna take and still talk shit? Alright, let's take it to BA. Oh, I already do. I'll go again. Nigga, we don't need three fucking deals to beat y'all niggas. Fuck out of here. You needed two to lose. Oh my god. I mean, I'm just, I'm just stating facts. I mean, I'm just saying, you're not gonna hold no territory now for this anyway, so fuck you talking. I don't, they don't oh, want to. Okay. That's, uh, that's what territory are you holding right now? Damn. Oh, God. shit. Oh, my God. Damn. Oh, your, guild, I mean, your, your guild mm. held the L in the territory? You held the oh, L's in BA God. last night, so I don't know why you're talking. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> this ain't going in a good direction, only my <laughs> dude. Let's wait till Striker yeah, come out, my dude. Let's wait till Striker come out, dude. Just come back later. Try again, dude. <laughs> you should come back later. <laughs> 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 I'm telling you, you know, no Striker, Striker, really gonna humble people real fucking quick, dog. Man, that shit now. My man's gonna put peanut butter on his controller and let his dog <laughs> lick it off. Start, start chewing on the keyboard and do two combos and win. Easy claps. <laughs> oh, Easy claps, dude. And then, then after that, people start getting cocky again, and Mystical come out to re-humble people again. Yeah, you'll see everybody that lost on their strikers be like, damn, I sucked this striker, so hold up, let me roll Mystic. Hey, I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> I'm about to be rolling Mystic. I don't want to hear nobody talking shit either, bro. I oh love Mystic. God. Oh, I'm rolling Mystic too. Whenever that happens. Hey, One I'm day on that. In a year. <laughs> I'm on that, bro. Let's get it. Just, just roll full DP evasion stack Mystic. Yeah, Piss a lot of people off. Really, then you hear the Kuno boys come out with the cut. <laughs> But I'll tell you what, all these mystics are going to be out there fucking 1v15 and then meet a deadly ass lawn that actually knows what the fuck they're doing. And that lawn's going to come slap a mystic. I don't know how many lawns, I mean, error.
but besides error, I don't know how many lawns are actually on PS4. Maybe Harley when he starts taking the game actually serious. We need competition for that. Yeah. There's like a good four to five guilds that's doing something right now, man. We need the PS4 community to step up, bro. Competition is no good. You just wait until the day, and then you go to every single node and see who has the most plays, and you just play. So you don't My God, is a PS4 it, podcast? Oh yeah, it's like uh, it's like a good like three to four nodes right now that's on stalemate. Nobody can take them because there's what like up, four man? or five guilds that Yo, just keep playing. What's up, man? I had to go celebrate, man. Yo, I'm, dude, I'm a little drunk. I'm sorry. Oh, I've been trying to get you in here for God knows how long. Blink said no. Y'all didn't want to participate. Uh, oh, listen, I was I was out drinking because. Why are your boy Blink being salty, dude? <laughs> <laughs> Blink's like, Blink's already drunk. That's why he's salty. <laughs> we understand. All right, so let's talk about Serenity and the territory then. Since, since we got Slay, the, the champions of territory, Serenity. So, Slay, what, what happened? What happened? Uh, so, uh, started out uh, right at the start. We placed. Um, let me get my map open so I can kind of walk through this. Uh, we had a few ideas of where uh, a couple of the nodes were at, um, like the forts. Uh, we had done a pretty good job scouting. We knew uh, who was going to be there. Uh, we knew it was Sequence. We knew it was Ash Equinox. We knew it was Barcode. Um, and we knew Ominous was going to be there as well, because obviously they were the territory owners. Uh, sequence plays right across from us. We knew where their base was. Uh, they had went to scout. We took their base down in 60 seconds. Uh, I took my horse in, broke a hole, yeah, that's ran in there, chopped it down. Like, so there was nobody on defense. Many, they were all out scouting. Uh, okay, that, so they took their whole ball out to scout. scout. That was bad planning. <laughs> yeah. How many, how many, how many did they have? No. Uh, I don't even know how many they had because there were like two people on defense when uh. I got there, and their base was gone before any of them got back. Um. Then from there, uh, we were looking for Ominous. Like, we wanted Ominous, we wanted Ominous. We ran into Ash Equinox first. Uh, Ominous yeah. was at Ash Equinox's base. Uh, we went in there, yeah. uh, made a push. Um, half white, half kill. Yep. <laughs> um, so, like, kind of both kind of wiped out on Ash's base. Uh, from there, we were like, okay, no, don't go to Ash. Let Ash and Ominous fight. We're going for Ominous's base. Uh, we found Ominous. Uh, they were pretty close to Glish. Kind of a bad spot because we just got to spawn a town and kind of basically run at you guys over and over again. Um, so we were just basically spawning a town, sending waves, sending waves, sending waves. Um, I would kind of go in on my horse, scout the base, look around. Um, was able to get a couple of charges off and open a hole in the corner. After about three to four wipes, um, we were able to finally get a push through their defense. Um, you know, get their base down. Um, it took a good bit. Ominous was honestly probably the best fight there out of everybody. Um, Damn. They had good numbers. They had um, some good players. Um, they wiped us quite a few times. Um, next was Ash Equinox. Um, they also put up a pretty good fight. Um, yeah, our uh, issues was because I'm here. So <laughs> our issue was is when you guys came in, Ominous had already weakened our watches and stuff from our previous yeah. fights with them. So you guys just took those down immediately, and then we just we were pretty much done because we had and, way less numbers. Yeah, and I took <laughs> my horse like, in <laughs> right on your guys' backside and popped your guys' yeah. iron barricades with like nine horse charges. Yeah, yeah Ash was kind of in the middle of everyone. They were the yeah. first yeah. to get picked every yeah, time. Got, they got hit pretty. Oh hard. yeah, we got pushed by three three guilds and had to repair a <laughs> fort immediately. So. And, uh, <laughs> right after we fought them off, yeah, it was bad. Barcode uh, was kind of doing all the looking out, um, looking for bases, so we let them leech the last 15 minutes of uh, the hour um, to kind of pay them for, for doing what they did. Okay, was it an alliance or did it just happen to be? No, I just impromptu, like, uh, into the war. Like, uh, I think they were more... Um, more inclined just to, to pilfer some funds. Um, they didn't really want the territory. Yeah. Um, what was the payout so, on it? Uh, payout on it was 1.4 bill. Okay. That should be okay. Pay, payouts are all fucked up. The exile one, you didn't make it. have been on there. Uh, so payouts are dependent on how much money goes through the market in a week. So if not a lot of money goes through the market in a week, payouts are going to be bad. Um, 
I think I saw huge increases in uh, the week that Siege came out because lots of people were paying money to buy costumes. There were lots of events going on, so there was lots of money going through the market. Uh, if there's not a lot of money flowing through the market, there's not going to be a lot of money going into the territories. That's just how the, the game system works. Yeah. I think things have settled down, and I think the prices for territories are going to settle where they're at now. Um, at least until we start getting some inflation into the game, this, this is where the territories are going to sit. Is that a glitch? So are you saying that in Valencia, if they put uh, so, the market, they'd be getting more? So with Valencia and Medea not being out, uh, the pay is split between the three territories. Um, when Valencia and Medea come out, they have their different, they have different pay ratios for, uh, the market tax. Um, I believe Balanos and Medea, not, sorry, not Medea, uh, Balanos and Serendia sit at about a 5% tax. Um, Calfion, I want to say is the same, but they also get the tribute, the tribute wagons from each territories. Yeah, so it's a 5% tax for Calfion, but they also get the... Uh, the tribute wagons. So if uh, the tribute wagon stays protected, they'll make way more money um, than the other two territories. If they don't, they'll make about the same. So it sounds like, though, since they're split between the territories now, that it'll actually go down even more when they release those. Yep. And another thing to count uh, into the yeah. fact that a lot of people don't really understand <laughs> is the longer a guild holds a territory, the more the territory happiness is and so the tax goes up on how much they can get from a territory uh based upon the happiness of the uh the residents within it which the happiness goes well, up as the many weeks as you contain it well the thing the thing is they 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 stayed very happy the happiness didn't go up it's their stability that went up yeah so and so you, when there's no changes in owners the stability will go up where do you like pull all this info from bro uh, I've been playing PC for going on five years now. Got you, got you. So. Well, damn. Maybe, maybe we just have less, less people or be because of the way the accessory pricing is right now because Xbox, even, even at the beginning. Yeah, and so that, that's another thing to look at Xbox, is Xbox is six months ahead of us. They've got six months worth of silver that hasn't been created in the game yet. Um, so, and that's just something that, uh, it's a lot of people, I, it's the one problem I have with BDO, whereas you look at a game like RuneScape, uh, RuneScape has quite a few things going for it when you look at a market. Um, you know, there's ways to create silver and there's ways to destroy silver. In Black Desert, there really isn't a good way to destroy silver other than buying cronstones, which right now, there isn't a good uh, group of people, you know, it's better to buy a costume for 80 mil uh, instead of, you know, buying 240 cronstones, which is going to cost you 480 million. Um, so that's that's the big problem I have with the Black Desert market is there's not a good way to destroy silver. To be fair though, I think uh, the central market in Black Desert has one of the most punishing tax systems out of any MMO. Oh, right. for sure, absolutely. Like so, that's that's like their that is their one way they do a good job of destroying it is through the tax system. But I don't I don't know that it can keep up with you know everybody grinding. Yeah, and the only other way I've really seen them even attempt that is with the whole mysterious accessories, you know, gamble. Um, yeah. That's a pretty good way to pull silver out of the... I know I've dropped about 8 bill on mysterious belts and shit, yeah. um, but you know, in the big picture, that's still minuscule amounts compared to how much yeah. people can grind, because you exactly. just generate them on trash, you know? Because, yeah. I mean, you, I mean... You're looking at probably anywhere from 25 to 30 mil an hour at places like anywhere in the like Valencia. Um, you know, that's it, that's without good drops. You know, and like, even in Medaya, like at yeah. Rogues, people are grinding Rogues an hour turning old bars. Yep. yep. You can still the same for Helms, still, man. Yep. Helms and uh, Sauce is still a great farm if you got the right setup in Central Market and Storage. very mate. easy in this game. Yeah, really, you can just pick your favorite spot and, and go to work, bro. I've been farming Pila, too. I, I've seen so many rare drops there. 
And then they give out all the silver, you know, for the family fame fund, you know, for guilds to get dispersed and all that yep. stuff. There's, there's lots of there's lots of silver coming into the market, but there's not really any good ways that they're taking it out. Um, and you know, that's obviously it's a it's an issue on PC. You look at PC and people are sitting, you know, you look at prices of what we've got and what prices of PC has, like <laughs> their market super inflated. Um, yeah, even on costumes, they're paying. Yeah. on Cronstone's buying costumes. Yeah, three times as much as we are. Yeah. Yeah. I was I was real happy to to go into siege this week, um, and there was lots of people fighting. It was it was I think it was this is a good week for BDO. Like uh, there was lots of changes, lots of good fights were going on, um, and I think it should stay like this. Like I I would encourage any small guild to to get into this because it, it was a lot of fun. Like uh, you know comparing this to to PC, like this is probably one of the most fun I've had as a BDO player um, in five years. Yeah. yeah. I respect that. Why we were to, the, to try to help get these guilds in here discuss maybe what went wrong, what went right, so these guys yeah. keep growing and getting stronger and helping it out. Yeah. So now some we just need to take extra so we can sh finish shaking everything up. Yeah. And uh <laughs> and I think uh I think Exile is they've got a good crew going. They've got, you know, they've they're sitting comfortable up there, but they're they're ready. Um, because I mean, we we the second week into Balanos, we went there. Um, they had they had any people there. Um, this was back before I think everybody was really past eight, you know, four fifty. Um, it was just the people that had been pushing really hard, but uh, they were they were super strong. Uh, Exile yeah, has we, been grinding we... in peace, man. You don't see or hear anything about an Exile member. And... Nope, they. Vex does a really good job, and I'll I'll I will give Vex any compliments any day of the week because he yeah. does a good job of running his guild. They stay out of drama. They, he doesn't they run stay the guild quiet. Anymore. Oh, he doesn't. Who who's Mike? Oh, uh, Mike's okay. Mike too. Mike's a really great guy. They, yeah, yeah, they he dropped his position due to uh, I believe medical reasons. So okay. well, he gave it. his no, position no over to Mike. Man. No boy. Um, I know we went after Exile the last couple weeks, and yeah, it wasn't pretty. <laughs> so did Conflict. Conflict went after him last week, and uh, they got wiped in like 20 minutes. Conflict. So like, it, 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 it didn't... They're very strategic, and they know, they know what they're doing and how to do it. And yeah. they bring the numbers, well, which, especially Witches and Wizards, and they'll... <laughs> Yeah, Honestly... that's one thing about Exile is they're very mm. unified and they got a really good bond. Like they don't have any like yeah. players that stand out as like god tier solo no, players to are, me. They are but all as different. a guild, they are very unified and very together. And their Exile is very good for that. Yeah. And the first time we the first time we actually fought Exile, I mean it was it was us flag up um and honesty back then they were Luna. Um, and they did a really good job of coordinating a defense and an offense in a 3v1 situation. Like, they were ready for it. They were coordinated. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I remember seeing you all base on that one. Yeah. I, I was going to question you all base. Yeah. Dude, I was I was really happy with I I didn't even have a look at the base, like our base that was made, but uh, our Death Forge uh, is who our makes our base. Um, did an astronomically good job. Like that's the main problem I see with people making square bases is it's like, um, you know, you get in, um, and with there only being four defenses, you know, you you take out a corner and there's you know that's it. Like that corner's open. You've got all the you've got free reign basically on that side to do all the damage. I think uh, you know there needs to be some experimenting in in terms of you know, making some better bases because. Everybody's making square bases, you know, it's, it's pretty easy to get into. It's basically the rinse and repeat, you know? Yeah, I think the grid limitations really, uh, really limits the creative ability, though, for base construction and BDO. Oh, for sure. Yeah. And, in, and in I mean, Falcon, something I don't know if you guys have talked really about. It's really garbage. You can't, you can't place half of anything in Calpheon Castle, dude. The grid's fucked up over yeah. there. Yeah. 
And obviously, That's you know, Siege is a good a good point right now because Siege is how this game is supposed to run. You know, everything's functioning properly in Siege. I'll say that the buildings and structures in Siege are a little weak right now. HP. Um, you know, I should not be able as a wizard to tear down a barricade within 30 seconds and bring their base down to 10% HP. Like, as one person... <laughs> Okay, Shit, the barricade had more HP than the fucking siege castle. <laughs> yeah. and, and, and that's that's a big issue. Like that that needs to be. No, I don't know. I'm, I'm, it just hasn't been the, changed. The ca they... the fucking castle gates didn't get buffed until comma. Yeah. So so siege on Calfion until that fucking gate gets buffed. That shit's paper mache, dude. Well, it'll literally know. be a legit GG. I feel like. I feel like it's easier to actually take down a siege tower than it is to even take down a node tower. I don't oh, know. I'm say that. Oh, yeah. 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 We still have the node core issue, so I mean that's that's a big problem that we need fixed <laughs> as a community. Um, that that Xbox didn't deal with. You know, they never had this you know participate issue where only the wizard and witches are dealing damage with their pets. Like yeah. so that's 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 the issue we found is it's you know we've been doing node wars this entire time, and yeah. Only wizard and witches with their flows are doing damage and with like lava pool and the pets attacks. You know, uh, mooses mm -hmm. can use projection, um, and then ninjas have a couple skills they could use that have involved with the kunai and the shuriken that can use. That's it, that's okay. all that does damage. Oh. Like, we okay, there are so, serious um, issues. So, I'm glad I'm not the only one who's noticed lack of damage dealing. Yeah, so it's no, uh, it, it basically. <laughs> As it is right now as a node war guild, which we're no longer, thankfully, because that, that shit's frustrating as hell, I'd rather have 99 <laughs> wizards and witches, because they're the only ones that can do damage. Yeah, and there's so a lot of other it. bugs, too. Like, uh, there's mm. a lot of things like wizard and witches specifically, uh, maybe a couple other classes, but on there. And, and I know I'm not the only guild that's run into this problem. I know Conker's run into a time before. Uh, the time zones aren't correct on the, the placing the forts. Oh like, my you, gosh, the yes. The time yeah, you have like to... Seven you have, I, I you started have to playing your, at 3 in the morning. You have to go to your PSN uh, settings and actually switch it to the time that it says. Yeah, which is you bizarre. You shouldn't have to do that, though. Yeah. Like, I see what you mean, but that's kind of crazy. I ran into crazy. that problem three or four times just trying to figure out when the cutoff was. Yeah, we've, and we've had several times we've gone to place on a fort we've taken last week, we couldn't replace. So we lose yeah. a node because we couldn't mm -hmm. place a fort on a node we've already taken, like the week before. And it's yeah, just like, we... there are lots of, for this being a PvP game, there are way, way, way too many PvP issues. Yeah, we gotta, we gotta reach, yeah, there is. reach out to the CMs. And let them but people have, them. and the only thing uh, that they yeah. say is, "Well, you can't hit the, the fort. Did you? I mean, did you sign up?" Do shit, dog. It's really on fucking Pearl Abyss. It's, it's the developers. Yeah, yeah they're community managers. Yeah. All they can do is take our opinions to the that's developers. Cool. Yeah, they can only push it, but that's about it. It's the devs yeah, who yeah. have yeah. the final say. They and I don't, I don't think they know what the issue is. Yeah. No, Quite because awesome. even on stream, they were like, there's no issue with Node War where we check the code, you know, we'll check it again, but everything's working, it's functional, and it's like, Did no, you hit participate? Like... That's all they said. Yeah. So that's a, that's a big issue. You guys Party. saw the recording. Yeah. That's the problem that they had on Xbox. Xbox, actually, the base is, like, how y'all noticed how squishy the towers, I mean, the doors were for the castle. Yeah. That's how squishy the base is actually used to be. Like a one man could take out the base, and that was a big problem on Xbox until the whole like all of Orsha, all of like the top guilds legit recorded it. Yeah. Like they don't do it until y'all can all come together and record it and show them because well, just because you're saying it. Yeah. yeah. They're and, not going to say, okay, yeah. let's go look at it. It's when I've streamed a few it. node wars where I've had the issue, um, and I've uploaded the, you know, the like the video um, and sent it to there. They've got an email where you can, you know, send in tickets and whatnot. Um, and I created a ticket, and it's been closed. Like they, they don't even look at it. Like, I, I don't, I don't know what to do. Like, like, they don't even respond to it. We can go public with it. Yeah, you know, yeah, YouTube. Like, we, we, I mean, we can post it on the. I don't have a Twitter, so I can't like go on their Twitter page and and post it. Um, but you know, I I I feel as a community we need to stress this because it's 
you know, it, it, it doesn't really affect the Siege guilds because obviously Siege is functioning fully properly, and it's because you don't have to participate for Siege. You know, you don't have to. Like, it pulls all 100 people into no matter what. Um, it's, it is a, truly a participation issue um, in terms of... Because only certain skills have the 100% accuracy. Uh, yeah. And, and so that's what it is. Um, and then another issue is just people loading in. Like, when you're loading into your forts and stuff, and just people won't load in, or, yeah. you know, the barriers don't load in, and you're just running into a wall repeatedly, and it rubber bands you back. Yeah. Like, you well, just and that's, <laughs> kick anywhere. That's, that's an issue that's on PC as well. You know, it is a, it's okay. a very... Okay, so it's not just... It's know. a very um, processor-based game. So, yeah. you know, the only really way you can buffer that is if you haven't bought a solid state yet, I would recommend to anybody. 100%. It's going to cost you 60 bucks. you know, but it's... It's going to be the best decision you ever make because you'll lose those issues 90%. No invisible walls. Loading in takes a lot less time. Um, you know, it sucks that I have to say, you know, hey, in order for you to play this game, <laughs> you got to spend more money. You got to spend more money. Yeah. But, you know, that's well, at the end of the PS5 day. When PS5 comes out, they're going to be doing it anyway. That's what I was going to say, yeah. 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 We've We've been telling most of our members, you know, especially the people that are a lot newer and still kind of getting a grip to the game, that solid states are almost more essential than pets are in Black Desert. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, because, the, because at least you can play the game without pets. You can't yeah. play the game without a solid state. Like, exactly. It's, yeah. it's terrible. Oh, it's so slow. Yeah. And you can't even play like uh, Red Battlefield. Like I was in there with no. Ambu and yeah. you know, and you go in and you see people frozen there for 45 seconds. And then mm -hmm. next thing you know, they're teleported across the map because you just now rendered 45 mm -hmm. seconds after you spawned. Yeah. Um, you know, yeah. And for a lot of people, Red Battlefield is one of the most fun parts of the game, you know? And, mm -hmm. and you know, because it, it brings in a pretty good PvP situation where, you know, it's like it's like pugs, basically. You know, yep. it's a pickup game. You put a whole bunch of people together and fight, um, and you can do that at any point of the day. Um, yep. So to not have these core functions of the game, you know, locked behind a $60 paywall where you've got to go, I think it's, it's, it's going to ruin the community. And I think, um, you know, potato mode will help that a little bit. Um, but... There's more behind it than just potato mode. Like obviously, rolling the graphics settings is going to help uh, because it's going to require it's going to lower the requirements for for rendering. But there's there's got to be some some compatibility issues as as well. Yeah. Hey, I like watching the sunset on this game. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that Halloween blood moon was kind of dope. But then <laughs> two o'clock in the morning, it's it looks lighter than it does it. You know, yeah, there, there's no <laughs> representation of actual like if it's later day. I'm like, what? And it sucks for those of us who can't see the top of our screen. Yeah, that's one thing. I actually don't have an aspect resolution uh, setting on my TV. I'm like, yeah, um, me either. And I, they don't have sliders. Like I, I tell people that all the time. Like it's nice actually going back and watching my videos because I'm like, oh, that's what a full screen looks like. Like even on a uh, world chat, I see the LD, and that's it. It's fuck. Yeah. So and, yeah, that's the thing. So people are like, just look at the top of your screen. I'm like, I don't have that part of my screen. And they're like, just adjust yeah. your TV. I'm like, I don't have that on my TV. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. what are you? I, don't... I mean, speak so, on that. We I also can... are missing a lot of options from the actual like UI customization that that truly allow for people to to customize the game and play it the way they want to. There's a lot of features from PC that we just don't have. Mm -hmm. yeah no, yeah. no xbox xbox has it there's mm -hmm. a video on youtube of it <laughs> yeah i so like I, why do you not have it i mean i was i i travel a lot for work so i'm currently in a hotel and like they had a tv and it was like i i couldn't play bdo on the tv because i'm missing literally oh, wow. my i couldn't see my health bar like that's like that's kind of oh my bar. god it's like so i literally had to you know take a three hour drive back up home grab my monitor bring it back down here so i can play the game from it's like that's I, I can't imagine these people that are playing on TVs that are missing the, you know, yeah, a good fifth bad. of their screen. Yeah. That's pretty and bad. It, uh, and time. what's crazy is it would be so easy for them to implement, like, as far as a coding issue, for them to implement simple things to make the game run better, like disable particle, uh, like remove uh, particle density or remove sh 
that spell effects. I mean, everybody wants good graphics, but not if your game don't run. Yeah, and that's yeah. and those kind of effects are standard in MMOs. Um, and it's really silly that a MMO that it gets so much funding through microtransactions won't take the time to pay their coding team to fix such a major issue that requires minor effort. Yeah, and it truly is coding because most people know me. I used to play Warrior. Um, I switched to Wizard because of the Wizard bug. You know, the Wizard's the only thing that can do damage in Node Wars currently. Barely. Uh, Barely. On Warrior, I can see every skill animation in the game. On Wizard, I cannot. So it's clearly, like, I didn't change what console I'm using. I didn't change, um, you know, what I'm running on. So it's it's clearly a coding issue. There's something wrong somewhere that you know, well, hasn't been it's the way that they're optimizing the game you got to think about it warriors have much less particles than a oh, wizard sure. has yeah. so when you, you play on a class like wizard with all the particle effects they're optimizing the game by completely removing the particle effects and, that's and their, so that that's their optimization yeah yeah like, and i feel I like yeah i feel like a lot of these issues being an issue so early in a hardcore game is honestly going to drive a large portion of the ps4 community away because ps4 is. players in general are very soft core casual based players like yeah. realistically like other consoles xbox pc they all have much higher competitive mlg brackets in almost every game um so yeah. with a very punishing, time-consuming, hardcore game platform, plus having all these bugs that makes it, you know, almost unplayable for casuals. I, I, it, the, I think the player base is going to rapidly fall, to be completely honest. And especially Which if their intention is to run these guys into Xbox and PC players. Yes. Like, you they got a lot to fix before guys that. To come into that scene and, like, be ready. Yeah, they got a lot to say, fix before that. It already kind of has, and, and if you think about it, that might be why you've seen, uh, you're seeing Node Wars and Siege Wars uh, not paying out as much as you're seeing on Xbox yeah, and PC, missing, because people are seeing players. terrible yeah. rendering, and they're leaving. Because <laughs> mm -hmm. so, I know a lot of people have quit. Yeah. yeah. So. Most of the right. people I started with either quit or are very casual, except with maybe yep. like five people that compete at very high brackets. But like most of the people I started the game with are already done. Yeah, um, I'd, I'd, exactly. I'd agree with that statement. I'm a life stealer, so don't add me. <laughs> <laughs> I believe it. I, I don't need I don't need graphics to fucking cook my foods. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> you look, you look at Freaking master that. three. No. No, I'm doing. Uh, I do alchemy and farming. Uh, AFK fishing, OP. Oh man. <laughs> it really is. I, can't I wait do those, fishing, those farming, come out. cooking, labs. <laughs> Processing, oh. gathering. Almost got, got that master gathering right now. Yeah, I've got oh, 500,000 strawberries waiting for those life stones to drop, baby. <laughs> uh, How about that fairy farm coming? Oh no, I, I didn't even do fairy on PC. Fuck that. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna be the annoying ass fucking DP witch with an auto potting fairy. Yeah, that's, that'll be. <laughs> that being said, that, br that brings me to another point. When I went to Pirate Island, everything rendered everything was beautiful like being away from the main island the game oh, yeah. actually runs so smooth oh, yeah. there's no one's there yeah <laughs> mm -hmm. what uh, yeah. Yep. Yeah. That's my fucking island. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yo, don't make me have to command yo, a yo i go perm red every time i go to pirates because i'm like i tr all the way damn if somebody's gonna come in my goddamn rotation You'll see me on main rotation, flagged up, killing everyone. I don't care. That's my spot. That that negative one mil perm red XP boost. I feel it, Jackrabbit, man. We warriors can't kill much, dude. Gotta be low HP targets. Jackrabbit kills everything, man. Yeah, Jack, Jack a fucking smack a motherfucker. Except wizards. Number one warrior, bro. I'll number tell you what, Nem. Number two. On his warrior either. Yeah. I tried doing uh, um, Achman on my warrior solo. Cannot. I can I can solo Achman on my wizard, but cannot solo it on on warrior. Get like a finesse of a warrior. Like Nim. Yeah, get like Nim. I mean, like uh, sorry, I can't is is probably a harsh word. I can't do it efficiently. 
Just our kill speed's not the same as wizard. It's like head chasing into a wall. <laughs> <laughs> it's like head chasing into a wall, that's right. I just, I think as, as a community, we need to figure out a way if, like, if we want to continue this, we need to figure out a way to get in contact with the developers, get in contact with the CMs, and, you know, we have to let them know that this is what we want. Well, if you've noticed, I don't think we have any partners with BOPS4 in this community. Yeah. So well, who's and, really communicating and, to and these Burger people? Partnered? I don't Murder Burger is partnered, but I that's my dude and everything, but I don't know how uh, in-depth he wants to go with the actual BOPS4 community. I feel like he just wants to stream. He, I don't think he really uh, is, is that far invested into BDO well, yeah, as a game. Y'all so want me to start streaming? Y'all want me to start streaming? That's why I'm here? Okay, I'll start streaming. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, y'all ain't gonna... Y'all gonna see me just light scale and you know role play. Yeah, Yo, start streaming those thirty man arms. Oh yeah, That's great just fun. Coke thirty man. I'm trying to get Coco to go meet me. Coco meet me in my Del Tavern. Have some RP going. He he never wants to hang. Yo, I got I got stuck up by RP players going to coming from Altadova to High Dell. They musketed me off my horse. I'm giving you all your silver. I was like, bro. What? I was having a nemesis. He was telling me the other day. He said, these guys just shot me off my horse. Yeah, what, what channel is the RP channel? Because I need to go there. It was on V1. Alright, V1. Let's see one, one, and then you got the casual toxic players and Calpheon 1 and 2. Oh, uh, no, yeah. They have toxic the players. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Imagine, imagine role playing Node Wars. <laughs> <laughs> Open the gate! Or teach. Open the gate! <laughs> <laughs> you go, you go open the gate from the inside! As a you, 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 gotta the RP the whole, <laughs> you gotta RP the whole thing, it's like a turn-based attack style. Oh you go! God. Now you go! <laughs> <laughs> this kill heals! <laughs> <I'm effective. laughs> <laughs> Um, yeah, I was I was clearly going for a whole uh, role playing thing, you know. Everything I have is, all of my characters are based after uh, sexual innuendos. Yikes! So clearly, I was Completely going for opposite. Something. I, uh, <laughs> that ever exists. I can't tell you any game I've ever played. I go for the money and the PvP. That's it. Yo, so while we have everybody here as a community, what do you like? Can we summarize? Like, what do you think are the main topics that the developers need to focus on? Like, while we have all most of the top players here, what do y'all think are the main topics that the game developers and the CMs need to focus on in order for this game to actually succeed or be more successful on PS4? Optimization, one hundred percent. Yeah, yeah uh, exactly. I, I think they need to to stop the new classes, the new territories, the new content. I think we've got enough content currently right now to to push ourselves uh, for probably a couple more months. And I think they need to take this time. They need to slow it down. They need to look at the bugs. We need to we need to have a fully functioning. Uh, PvP system. We need to have node wars up and running so that smaller guilds can actually do damage, ter so that ter so that nodes don't go stalemated when there's more than four guilds placed. I think that's a huge issue. Um, you know, because that's that's causing a lot of guilds to not even want to get into the node war scene, and that's mm -hmm. you know that's what this game is about. You know, it's a PvP game. You know, this and a lot of the small yeah wanted to you couldn't make it past the bugs like. Yeah. Figure a lot of the casual aren't in depth enough and not you know conflict uh, solution enough to go into their settings and actually like mess with the day and time just to place a node. Like people aren't gonna do that unless you're actually hardcore. So stuff like that probably scares a lot of people away from even trying to make it, and then they actually get there and everything's still bugged. Yeah, like I can't tell you how many like the first week of the game came out like. like 
when like it was a real issue and nobody figured it out. Like, I can't tell you how many node warriors we went to and didn't do a single damage to a fort just because we couldn't figure it out. Mm -hmm. yeah. Like, and, and <laughs> guilds, guilds that didn't do that, they, like, aren't node war guilds anymore. Like, I can't tell you how many guilds, like, yeah. the guilds I see doing node wars now, Spare, Conflict, Autumn, uh, You better spare weren't... Autumn, bro. <laughs> yeah, that weren't, they, they weren't guilds that have been from the start. Like, all the guilds that I see doing node wars are guilds that were have from the start doing node wars. Yeah. That's true. Pretty much. Yeah. Yeah. So there's there's no new no war scene. Like we like and, and that's bad for the game, man. Like we there needs to be new guilds. There needs to be you know, like a subclass, you know, the T one guilds, the T two through four guilds. Um, and there needs to be the siege guilds, and sometimes the node war guilds need to band together to try to take a territory together. You know, that needs to happen because it breeds good competition. Gameplay. Yeah, so that's uh that's what was like you know my main focus when i uh broke off of several other guilds in the past is like i want more competition in the game like there yeah. be very healthy competition it's not healthy for a game to have one or two dominant guilds it's it's just not no. um and it's People need to see other guilds come up out of nowhere, guilds that have never existed before, and come from absolutely nothing, and then become top to give people, like, to let people know that it is possible, rather than, oh, look, I joined late, oh, I don't have a good guild now, so I'm never going to be top. Reality, we need a crush, or it's going to destroy the entire game. Yeah, I, mean, I think you ask, you know, any of the siege guilds, you know, do you guys want to sit on a territory? For six weeks and do nothing. I mean, it's gonna it's gonna nothing. happen, dog. Like like no matter, even if somehow, you know, the siege guilds we fucking somehow try to build more out. Like, yeah. it's 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 honestly gonna end up like how Xbox did it, where the big siege guilds, whether it's us or Carnage or whoever, fucking just goes and t like shows fucking smaller guilds how to rise up and try to help them out because if not it's honestly gonna just stay like how it is currently it's gonna be karma versus carnage and exile and fucking whoever else decides to step up on the play like it's gonna stay like this unless like these other little guilds fucking they disband and they merge into each other and try to coordinate structure and if they don't well i mean the i mean ain't nobody doing no t1s bro those are snipes and t2s yeah. are fucking yeah. jokes so it's oh, like if yeah. they're not if they're not doing, if they're not big enough to handle T3s at minimum, that node war scene is dead. Because like now, you know, us as Karma, we're gonna be on node. So I mean, I mean that should, I mean there's only so many guilds we can expect to fight on node war. It's not like some fucking like lottery of like oh who we're gonna fight this time around. It's gonna be the same. Oh, yeah. show you know who you know who exactly you're gonna fight against, and that's the biggest. Yeah, issue. it's like there, there's no. Yeah, so it's not like a big like fucking, and, and and the crazy part to think, like now that we're gonna be doing node wars for a while until we can attempt to get the castle again, is that the majority of people who are in this call at the moment, those are the majority of people that you're gonna see in node wars, yeah. Yeah. and and that exactly. and, and yeah. a, apart from that, like what else is there? Ain't no like, like pro like if conflict got their shit together, probably them, but like besides conflict. Uh, maybe maybe autumn. Fucking who knows, dude? Like honestly, it's it's a gamble. And at this point, because if if like if we just laugh at guilds, you know what I'm saying? Like if we just laugh at guilds, like I, I know fucking conquers snickered uh, at um at conflict. But if like we don't help the other guilds, to, like try to you know even outperform us at times, there's and not going to be any competition. That's something I'd like to touch on a little bit. Um, one thing I would like to see come to BDO PS4. Um, that is a big issue in my opinion. Uh, when I talk about conflict, uh, the one thing that stands out to me is disorganization. And the reason because of that is because they play in party chat. There needs to <laughs> Thank be... Thank God you said it, bro. I Discord forgot about that. on PS4. Yep. I mean, 100%. That, that you happen. need it. Oh, yeah. they, they probably have a contract with Microsoft, honestly, so... That shit ain't well, gonna then happen, something though. needs to be on PS4. 
then I yeah, mean, we, what, we need what, something. What yeah. else of communication is there besides Discord? Really, ain't nobody we doing team speak? Team speak, but yeah, <laughs> nobody <laughs> using that no more. Ventrilo, nobody's using that anymore, dude. It's all Discord, bro. I mean, Skype, but <laughs> so <laughs> that's <laughs> ain't, ain't nobody <laughs> doing none of that. Why? <laughs> Like besides Discord, I mean Discord is it's free, it's it's extremely functional and it's like it, yeah, it's the yeah. best Trendly common source of community. Yeah. Like so, if you look at yeah. all the guild recruitments, it's all Discord. You don't see no team speak, you don't no. see no sky because that, that that's all bullshit. Yeah, you know, you know besides that, Discord to be a because we we have we have PS4 video partnered servers and you know, when I look at, I don't know if our, or not our node war, but our, um, our boss server, like video PS4 bosses, we've got over a thousand members in that. Like, if if that's the case, we need to try to get some of our partnered servers in contact with Discord, uh, because um, I think that would be a huge help for the game. I think yeah. some people need to stop and talking to talk and actually walk the walk because when I hear a lot of people over here talking about build up guild, build up, do this, do that. But I doubt yeah, that that's you know, actually going to do that because me and Jack Rabbit legit took time out of our weeks. To, that was the whole ominous thing. We tried to go. I went and talked to them for a minute. Seeing that they, like, they had a good structure core, they actually just wanted to build up like lower people like i talked to their gm for a while and he didn't give a fuck he would bring it like he goes through like their little two gm will go through and pile on people all day yeah they have That's... So many people all day just to teach them why they're power leveling them teaching them how to play the game jack took shadow bringers under his wing before the little thing that happened with them he would go <laughs> over there helping them here and there's a lot of people over here talking about what they need to be doing as a group, what we need to be doing as the bigger guild, but half of the time, none of y'all have even probably attempted to try that. I mean, we definitely haven't done anything about that outside of guild. Inside guild, um, you know, that's something we've done and we focus on a lot, is we have our officers run, you know, power level sessions. We run people through the Vulnacy quest line Because when you look at the gear score average as a server, I'd say we're somewhere around the 400 to 450 mark. And when you look at 450 gear score, that's full tri armor uh, and priasulas. That's, that's all it takes to get to 450 gear score. And as most people in this Discord know, that does not take a lot of effort. You could do that in one day. Yeah. Okay. So on that Another subject, thing. I will say that once again, Origin has taken in a good. 40 to 50 new players and we give we give everyone the same chance to get the information talk to us ask as many questions as possible we will give you every piece of advice in order to grow and i'm not even gonna lie karma did do that somewhat when i joined karma i was like 3 320 gear score 330 i will give you that there were people that was joining i personally believe that these gear score requirements are hindering people more than encouraging them because i personally brought in people that were 360 gear score and they end up being 470 480 in like a week or two weeks because they're motivated and they're with players that they love not only that my discord is open origin discord is open to the community so anybody can come in ask questions gain information and do what they need to do in order to progress their gear if we have more communities like that not just origin then we will have more dedicated players or more people that are motivated to actually become a dedicated player since the beginning um who has really just been saying but I'm just gonna keep bringing up Jack's name. But who besides Jack and a few others actually sat in BA? I can name Reset currently in my guild that used to teach Witchers. He didn't even care. He used to teach people Ranger and all of this. Show them to the the little attack dummies and actually go show them moves because. I'm not capping. I'm not lying here. I a still do it to this day. Yeah, they still will do that. I'm seeing a lot of people that 
Jack or somebody will go show something. He'll go show them a basic combination, basic combo and all of this. And they will go and be selfish and now you don't tell nobody about it. Yeah, like uh, added to that, like I had a few, uh, what is it, Arab. He taught a few of my core members a lot of this. Like he was teaching me how to play lawn. And then he taught a few of my uh, my guys their core their core uh, core rotations as well. So like, it just it just takes time for everyone to be able to get things going. To be honest, yeah, yeah. That's a that's one thing that I noticed that people should really focus on here. Um, a lot of people get information and don't spread it. Like I am brand new to Black Desert. I just started on PS4. Um, and. I think I'm pretty well educated by this point, but that's, and I, I like to, you know, take everything I know. Like I, I learn new shit every fucking day. Um, but I still like to anything that I learn, teach everybody that asks a question to, because like, I don't care if you're in a guild that we're perm decked on or, you know, somebody that used to slap me around and be a whatever. It doesn't matter because anything I teach somebody else, you know, they can then go relay that information to the rest of the community. And since black, poor job on teaching people how to play the game and like the hidden mechanics of it we definitely need more things like that rather than people just like ripping down everybody because they don't know anything yeah and like i try to like you can ask ram and even for uh for conquerors like i love doing content you know what i mean so i don't care if it's just any you know small guild or even bigger guilds like i want to do content and promote everybody like you say you want to do content with me even if we have beef like i'll drop your discord off in the description i've done it for xbox guilds i've done it for mini guilds like i just want to be able to have a more better community because like right now a lot of the shit is just re really toxic and then there's not a lot of people doing any no work so it's more snipes than actual fights in the last three or four weeks so like it's just it kind of seems like it's getting kind of boring and then a lot of people are starting to quit and then just doing life skill and shit because there's no point in just tossing tossing a snipe up every time because like for example we was getting ready to fight fonde tone and the only thing they had was a damn tower up they didn't even build around it because it's just <laughs> normal snipes now you know what i mean yeah and i'm not calling them out but it's just like that's the only thing that was there like it was just two guilds and then they wasn't even there to defend it you know like we was expecting a fight and then there was no one there so it was nah. just like yeah, and that's a problem right now, especially with our guild, because since we are, you know, recruiting more casual players and trying to teach them how to, and you know, motivate. get to top tier, it's, we have one of two things happen where I go into a, or we go into a node war and somebody like me or Malachi or Conkers goes up against somebody that we can 1v their entire guild. And like, rolling somebody that bad isn't good like to show your new members it, it's just not but then you go up against anybody that's actually established and then you get completely rolled because you only got six seven members in your entire guild you know that compete at that level and everybody then gets discouraged because they accidentally die to a witch's pet like so there there's not enough guilds in the mid tier you know to help people because they're either all afraid or i don't know what the cause is but it's really hard to really hit that mid tier right now to build people up and motivate them to keep progressing yeah. and yeah, i think yeah. it's there's also an issue yeah. of you know ps4 stubbornness too like i think there's a lot of guilds that you know want to start you know it's it's tough to start a guild right now there's not a lot of I want to call free agents you know Maybe sitting out there without a guild um you know for a, for a most part you know there needs to be some guild merging you know there needs to be people that are cool with you know sharing leadership together um to progress themselves forward as a group instead of you know focusing well i've got my small family i need to protect you know it's there's not that many people out there that you know are going to want to join a small guild you've got to band together with other small guilds um yeah. and make yourself something um because yeah. i mean touching on what he said like you know it's when we go into node wars it's like two things it's like okay we actually have to you know do structured fights against these guys or it's like all right it's just rbf because these guys are bad um yeah and then that's, um that's also awesome. like what origin uh, or what Oro conquers was saying is that like a lot of our players like all of most of honesty and luna's players started literally this game like they're new and then they just got the game and then like we take in a lot of new players and yeah it might take a little you know little time to get everyone up to par and like hell we still are working on it but you like you get more dedicated players who actually enjoy playing node wars and they're coming just from the new core than the actual veterans who are kind of being towards stubborn and not want to teach anyone. Like, yeah. well, hell, we don't know a lot of people, but we don't know a lot ourselves. But 
teaching these new players a lot of things to get them like pushing you know gear score requirements i'm not gonna lie it, it kind of hinders a lot of recruitment because i noticed when i tried doing a 375 400 450 gear score requirements i wasn't hitting any barely anybody wanting to join but as soon as i drop the gear score requirements i'm getting five or six people wanting to get interested in it I and just feel see, like it's that's yeah, and that's a problem we're running into that I explain to a lot of our recruits because everyone's like, oh, what's your guys' gear score? I see videos, you, 1VX, and all these top players, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, look, we don't have a gear score requirement. We have a dedication and activity requirement. Like, we'll take you. I don't care if your 320 gear score and started yesterday. You know, if or I don't care if your 320 gear score and you started when the game came out. Obviously, there's some information you're missing. Um, but if you're on every day and you ask questions and you're willing to show me that you're willing to progress – you know, I'll show you the ropes all the way through everything I know. I, you know, I'll walk you how to power level, how to run the Valencia one quest line, you should, how you should, you know, all that. And after the first week, you know, we kind of have a breakdown, you know, who's active, who has a guild contribution, who's been in Discord. That's a big one, you know, because you could tell who's dedicated. And I, I've noticed a lot of um, progression, not as where, far as gear score or um, no but overall progression in community um, just from being that way. And I've noticed a much uh, less toxic community within ourselves. Um, I mean, there's still bad apples here and there, and everybody has bad days, which, yep. you know, we can only grow as a community together. And, you know, a as persons, I know I still have a lot of growth to do myself personally. Um, I noticed, you know, I'm glad you brought that up. Because there's, if we want to talk about things that need to be fixed, um, we're missing a lot of guild functions too. Um, like, we can't go in a guild and see who hasn't logged in in a while. Mm -hmm. um, you know, that's that's a really important function. You know, like I can't even go through my member list um, and see who hasn't logged in like within the past three days, who hasn't logged in a week. Who, you know, that's that's something that needs to be added into the game and something. That's also, time play part of the game for a while. Yeah. Mm hmm. Yeah. And like, that's that's one thing that's really hard to manage, Um, you know, especially in a new. We'll see people die in the kill feed or, you know, it'll be purge day and we'll see 54 contribution. And we're like, who is this player? I've never heard of their name. I've okay. never seen them in discord, you know, and, and it's really bad that that's the only way you can really keep track and go off of it. Yeah. Yeah. In, in actuality, that could be a guy that just doesn't do quests and does nothing but grinds all day, but you mm -hmm. don't know because you can't look. You have no way to tell. Mm -hmm. Yeah, absolutely. So that's that's a thing that needs to be fixed. I think there's multiple things there, but, you know, that's going to be our personal model as Origin, and, you know, this is going to be my home until I quit the game just because this is... I, I've been in top you know guilds my entire gaming career and i took a step back to be a little less hardcore this time and build up the community because every other mmo i've ever played has had the community there in place where um being a new player to black desert in general i can yeah. already see that black desert does not have the community behind it that it needs to succeed as an mmo long term and honestly that keep progressing as you know a negative manner um that's going to be really bad for ps playstation and console in general because you got to realize like this is the first generation of serious mmos to hit console yeah. and if stuff like this fails because eso was okay but eso kind of tanked so did terra and you know if it keeps following that trend um they're going to be like there's no point for us to fund bringing mmos to console so that that's something that definitely has to change overall as an entire community aspect. And please, yeah. please bring mouse and keyboard to PS4. I want to throw <laughs> oh, this Jesus. fucking controller out the window. <laughs> <laughs> See, I, I play only for controller. I, I have a built gaming rig here, and I just I, I don't find keyboard. And I think it's it's definitely it's definitely a per personal preference kind of thing. Yeah. Cause like I see uh, people that play competitively. You know, Counter Strike, they'll play with a controller. People that mm -hmm. play competitive for Call of Duty, they'll play with a controller against other people that are mouse and keyboard. It's, it's a personal preference thing. I think that needs to be an option. Yeah, especially well, when there are players. Like, um, there's a thing that I feel like, because um, I I played Final Fantasy for a good bit, the Final Fantasy 14, and they had the same thing with console and P uh, PC, to where you can be able to run 
like your mouse and keyboard based through your console. So like, I feel like that feature could be really helpful because, you know, like they, it's not like it's impossible. Another MMO already no. done it. So like, it's not that hard, but like the thing that I felt like if BDO actually did input is that they allowed you to change your UI a lot to customize and at least customizing the UI. Cause a lot of this shit is cluttered to be honest. Like, See, the one like they don't issue, have the keyboard. The one issue you, you run into the with that though is skill difference because somebody that's skilled with a mouse and keyboard will always shit all over anybody yeah. <laughs> on on a, on a controller and that's just how it is because of precision, you know, pixel input sensitivity and just optimal keybinds um, I mean, on a on a thing. To so an extent, I would agree with that. Um, it, it's just it's just facts, and that's why a lot of games that are PvP based do not implement it. Um, that's why you see a lot of that stuff in games that are very PVE based because then you're, you know, helping each other rather than going against each other. But I tell you right now, like if you go up against a ninja on a mouse and a keyboard or like a good witch using mouse, like they will wreck anybody on a controller. That and you know, there's no way around that, unfortunately. I mean, I think there needs to be some. I think they. I think they have a long way to go in terms of controller optimization. Yeah. But, I mean, there there are games where I play against people, um, you know, with a controller, um, that can you know outplay me, um, on mouse and keyboard. Not, and I don't. I'm not saying that I'm the best at any sort of game, but no. I, I think I think there's exceptions to the rules, uh, for mouse and keyboard and controller, but I think. If we're talking about this game, there needs to be more controller optimization. There are a I lot agree. of classes yeah. that can't do combos that PC players can do mm -hmm. uh, because yeah. due to lack of uh, skill command. I mean, hotkeys. Yeah, man. Yeah, Usually, correct. you only have so many buttons. This is the, yeah, yeah there's limited, a lot of the times limited. I'll go to cast one ability, but it'll have almost the same buttons as another, and like mm -hmm. controller input is delayed. So it'll it'll register as something else that it didn't want to cast because you have to add one shoulder button, but that yeah. one shoulder button was in my previous combo. And I'm sure Jackrabbit can can testify. There's lots of warrior combos that just don't work on this because. Uh, you know, there's other skills that kind of line up with the same kind of key combos. You know that you have to. You, I had to kind of adopt a PC combo uh, to fit Warrior in order to make it work. You know, there's a oh, little yeah, bit of frames. Yeah. yeah, yeah. But yeah, the, the lack of frames thing. Yeah, the, you know, yeah. Warrior is it, it's one of the few classes that like is unplayable under 200. <laughs> The FPS is so bad over here to yeah, me. Yeah, yeah, the There was I, like... I can't quite simply can't cast ankle break twice because I don't have, you know, I'm capped at 60 FPS. All That's right, another so... thing, though, with uh, mouse and keyboard is I think uh, I think it's not going to be that much of an, uh, of an issue on average, though, because, number one, like, you only get the cap was, like, very, very, very top tier. But I think as far as hardware goes right now, it's capped anyways because there's so many frame drops and shit that you can't be as precise as PC. Oh, yeah. All right, so I feel like, you know, we, we've summarized mainly everything that the community needs to speak about. You know, we've spoken about optimization. We've spoken about the community aspect of lower guilds not wanting to push themselves and gain the information. We speaking about you know helping newer players get into the game become competitive um you know we released a lot of information there's a lot of people watching this podcast um you know i'm gonna upload it on youtube um i personally there's like well, 45 that, people uh, right now Google, Google media files i can be able to upload on mine as well yeah we can we can definitely do i'll send you a send it to you and let you upload it for sure I got you. um so you know, like I said, I feel like we've we, we've touched on most of the topics we need to. Um, we need to get this to the CMs. We need to get this to the devs because if we want BDO PS4 to succeed, um, we actually we need communication to the people that are creating this game. You know, for sure, man. Yeah, like it's it's you know we can only do so much as a community, and you know at some point in time we need we need help from you know the devs. You know, there's there's issues we can't fix as a group of players and right. i think that's the big issue right now 100 percent. we we definitely need a partner streamer to communicate this stuff to or a partner video partner whatever you know youtuber streamer whatever so we, we need someone to communicate 
<laughs> I, it, it, I think it needs to be multiple people. I think it's multiple. Like, you know, it's it does. Yeah. It really does. Start streaming. Instead of just being yeah. partnered just for your own revenue, why not be partnered to help build a game that's bringing you revenue, right? Yeah. So, like, I mean, if that's blindly like, stream mock now. Okay. I, I mean, <laughs> when I and stream, I, mean, I can actually see my whole screen, so that's nice. Yeah, oh, yeah that's, that's true. That's yeah, I've noticed that. That's like. <laughs> Yeah. That's weird. And with that being said, though, like if that's going to be a real thing and we're going to encourage um, more content creators spread throughout, we also have to hold stop the thing as a community where, you know, just because someone's salty about another guild, you know, tank and stuff like that, because that's just, you know, that's going to negatively impact the entire community in the long run. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Uh, no for here. No hard feelings, Carnage. We just wanted to have fun tonight. You good? Yeah. I didn't want to have. Listen here, y'all. Oh, no wait, shit. Wait. I'll catch you. <laughs> I'm gonna catch you. <laughs> and that's and that's one thing. Like I've 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 tried to do as a guild is I I try to be as as, as open and. Um, you know, straightforward. Like, I like I I've heard rumors that you know that I've got a spy in the guild. I don't care. Like, I we don't hide anything. You know, we put it out in general chat where even guests can see it. You know. Yeah, that's how we are as well. And we, like, and we toss Discord. stuff out. We toss stuff out, and you know, we toss our Discord out. With everybody. Yeah. Everybody. Oh, uh, <laughs> that was not me. <laughs> Yeah, that's oh, how yeah. we are as well. We're like, we don't care, you know, who's in Discord because we have people all the time. Oh, did you see so and so? I'm like, I don't care. Like, let them. I hope they, you know, I <laughs> hope they engage. Like, I, I'm not somebody that kicks people out of Discord over pettiness or anything like that. Like, I hope people that, you know, don't like me are in our Discord seeing us grow and seeing us benefit the community. And, like, you know, I think that's the mentality that everybody should have. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. That being said, you know, we can be cordial and still fight and have fun you know what oh, i mean absolutely like i love helping out everybody but i mean most people know i'll be the first person to jump into ba or anything involving oh, yeah. pvp like I, I love that shit but like yeah. you know i can still be and we were just talking about that today you know i can deck on somebody for an entire week and you know 1v4 people and then go and you know ha have tea with them lat later and you know BA. Like, <laughs> <laughs> Like, I, I hold no hard feelings. I prefer Dr. Pepper. Hey, yeah, I, I got you, though. I, I, Dr. Pepper Cherry, I got you. <laughs> uh, we were chilling with um, um, the, the um, fucking Karma Boys the, the morning. I don't really care. This is a game. We can have beef. Like, the whole reason with the Karma Cardinals beef, it's not because we dislike each other. It's because we're top guilds and... Yep. Like, um, before Valencia came out, Demon offered me, he was like, oh, we should become an alliance and all that, blah, 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 shares Valencia. I'm like, no, that would just destroy the game. game. Yeah. Yeah, you can see like, You got to do it. Help yeah. me. I'll leave the game for like... like, the only person that I'll keep saying, do not like in karma is PvP. Anybody else? <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't think half a karma likes pvp who so. is that pvp guy pvp the yeah. fucking retard bro <laughs> yo so on that note you guys just want to let you know uh i gotta go to work i start a new job on monday i need to reset my schedule i've been up too late <laughs> but this is uh this is it's been a two hour podcast <laughs> i'm gonna go ahead and end it here <laughs> You know, well, obviously y'all can do your thing, but I'm just we gonna end the that, stream, so you guys. Uh, I'm gonna send you the link of the video on Twitch, and you can just download it. Okay, well, I can download it from there. Yep, yep, yep. But all right, though, y'all. Um, appreciate everybody being here. Thank you for all the good info. I will see y'all in game. Peace. Peace, man. Yo. <laughs> Round. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie. One of the, <laughs> this week has been a fun ass week. I'm gonna be honest. Oh, dude, this is this is this has been a really good week for BDO, in my opinion.